Hey, what's good? This is JC from my own pocket. What I got before you today is an ASUS ROG Zephyrus G14 gaming laptop. Now, this gaming laptop is powered with an AMD Ryzen 9 chip. The Ryzen 9 chip is the ultimate chip right now for games that are graphically intense. It will load it up and, and handle it smoothly with no problem whatsoever. And this one in particular, it comes with a 16 gigabyte of RAM with an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060. And this also is a one terabyte, comes with a one terabyte SSD and the color is moon white, which I like. I like it, I like this color better than the black one with the M16, Machine Gun 16. And this one comes with a beautiful four, 14 inch uh, full HD display with a 144 hertz refresh rate and it's a 1920 by 1080p resolution and it's an LCD monitor so you're gonna get nice it's gonna get nice and bright and the color is gonna be nice and detailed not only dark but it's gonna be just as good and this one like I said it already comes with a 16 gigabytes DDR RAM, DDR4 RAM so for it's good for running um, graphic heavy games so you're going to be in good you're going to be in good hands with this right here and also is it comes with the nvidia geforce rtx 3060 and um it's also backed with a six gigabyte g ddr6 dedicated video memory for ultra fast advanced game advanced gpu for, to fuel your gaming so you're gonna have you're gonna have a great experience playing your favorite games maybe call of duty or whatever it is you're gonna have a great experience and this one is virtual reality ready so if you got um, um like your oculus rift and other vr this is made for it so this is vr already so get excited it comes with the four speakers powered by dolby atmos technology now the best laptop not so the best laptop but the laptop with the best speakers i've tested so far was the hp omen that had two speakers but it was but it was powered, but it was powered by banger and offset it was loud and it was pretty clear and nice and I loved it. But this one got four speakers powered by Dolby Atmos technology. So this should be the so the sound quality should be amazing. The weight of it is only 3.6 pounds, so it's not that heavy, and it measure at 0 0.70 inches thin, so it's not that thick either. Beautiful. It comes with one HDMI port, it's a HDMI 2.0, not 2.1. So you won't get 120 FPS. It may get high as maybe 60 or 80 because it's HDMI 2.0 but you can connect to multiple monitors so that's a cool deal right here it also is powered with a Wi-Fi 6 so you're gonna get the best connection possible um, it all depends on your IAPS your internet service provider what kind of internet um, plans you have but you're gonna get great connection from a great range and great great speed and also this bad boy comes with um, um backlight so you got um you can control the backlight to make it dim or bright you got you got um backlighting which is awesome i like that about it and the thing i like about this thing which is amazing you got a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack port is doubled as a ear ear earphone jack and a mic that's just a beautiful touch it comes with a two-way ai noise cancellation with 3d mic array what it is, it does a two-way AI noise cancellation and clarifies upstream and downstream audio. It filters out unwanted noise to make voices, voice and communication clearer. So it's gonna block out every dis so you could have maybe like a fan in the background or like a noise, it's gonna block it all out. So you get a nice clear um, audio. So your viewers can hear you, hear your voice very clear, you want to put it that way. It also got a, fe a security feature that most don't have. M most um, use your face for unlocking. It's got fingerprint, and I think fingerprint um, scanners are one of still still one of the most safest way from security. And um, unfortunately, this doesn't come with a front-facing camera, so bear that in mind. And a lot of these laptops nowadays, gaming laptops, come with Xbox Game Pass Ultimate, where you could get where you can um, play up to 100 of 100 of Xbox games and um, it's, come, it's one month for free and they got some nice plans going on right now so you just give it a try check it out so enough of me yapping let's open up the box and see what it looks like this one it was an excellent condition I picked up for my favorite retailer Best Buy shout out to Best Buy you guys rock all the time so let's see what it looks like 
I got my like, scissors right here, my unboxing tool right here, scissors. Uh, let me see what's inside. Like I said, it's just an unboxing. The other reviews are due in a few days. Actually, no. I'm gonna wait until next year because it's Christmas time. Everybody want to enjoy themselves, so I don't want to bore you guys. All right. So this is rip, 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 and it's Giz Quad certified. Just to let you all know. So let's see what's inside this box right here. I'm not done yet. Oh, I'm not done yet. Oh, there's so many things going on right here, guys. Boom, boom. All right. So I'm over ready. Let's see what we got. That's one thing I always like about ASUS. ASUS know, know to make a present, know to give you a great presentation for the products. So let's see right here, see? Open the box nice and easy. And you can see right here. Pull up the camera real quick. ROG, Republic of Gamers. That's what I like, I like the presentation. But before I get into the PC itself, let me put it to the side. Let's open up the box so you can see. Beautiful. As you can see, the, they, they know how to sell their products. Rep ROG, Republic of Gaming. I, I love this. So let's see what's in the side box right here. Oh, let me put on the camera real quick. Let's see what's coming to the side box. Oh, I guess this is a cord right here. Easy AC, boom. And also, I think it comes with a USB type C Thunderbolt. So I think, don't quote me wrong on this, you can charge your laptop with a, with a USB type C cable. Well, let's see what it brick and it comes with a four cell battery so that should be very good and the art uh, the the Ryzen 9 chip is very poor um, very uh, energy efficient so you should be able to play games for a good while just on battery power only which is awesome but this brick right here is um uh, 100 to 240 volts with 60 hertz 2.5 amperes 180 the output is 180 watts this will power it up real quick, real good. I like that. Anything else inside the box here? No, not really. So let's see what's inside this other compartment. Okay, nice black box. The beautiful ROG um, embroidering. This is the coolest I've seen in the market. The old mini is okay, but I always I was, I was fascinated with the ROG embroidering. It's awesome. Let's see what's inside this package here. Like I said, just the unboxing. So if you guys want to see my everyday use and gameplay, subscribe and hit the notification bell. Alright, there's some booklets that come inside the little box. See, I'm gonna put it back. And if you guys know me, every time I, every time I do an unboxing, I like to keep things nice and neat. So in case you gotta return it or sell it, everything is in good it's in good condition. And I don't sell items, but I guess if one day I want to sell them, hit me up on my email. It's right here in my about in my profile. Okay, what's inside here? Nothing else? Oh, that's it. Oh! I see this right here in the box. It says the HDMI with the ROG again. Like I said, they know how to sell their products. It gave me no book PC. Oh, these are some of the features right here. With the cords, the ports, charge your notebook. It's a charge your notebook. PC for three hours when using the first, use it for the first and charge up for three hours. Only use a bundle port adapter for charging. Oh. So I guess I can't use the, th the USB Type-C then. Okay, so you can use uh, one hand to lift it up. Lift up in the display. And that, let's see what's back here, what else? You press the power button, boom. Straightforward. That's what they like, it's very straightforward. All right, so what else inside, let's see what this. We got another compartment right here. And it's up. And it's nothing. So, comes out like a baggie right here. What do you want to do with it? I'm not going to encourage y'all to do anything illegal, but do what y'all want to do. Alright, let me get it out of the way. Now, for the coup de gras. For the coup de gras. Ladies and gentlemen, drum roll please. Boom. Ooh. Yes. This is it. I love it. You know what this can remind me of? Okay, let me just say some real quick you know when um the xbox um series x came out or xbox one x came out you got the regular version where it was big and chunky and then later on in the year they come out with the with the slim edition or what and the slim the m16 is a little bit chunkier than this 
and this so the MTX scene would be like the first Xbox One X and this version right here would be like the would be like the Xbox Slim because this one is really slim look at it you can see the HDMI port right here the USB type C the, the 3.5 millimeter that, that doubles as a as an earpiece and a mic and boom there's another USB type C right here with two um, um, USB type A and a Kingston lock and this is this feels very good in the hands look at this look at this in the light and it's like a holes right here nice and shiny you kind of reflective and also I love, like I said I love how ASUS sell their things they know how to sell their products see Republic of Gamers established 2006 so this so they've been around for like 15 years so they're very well established you can see right here you got the vents right here on the side to dissipate cool um the heat so you got one on each side as you can see for yourself right here and you got two in the back boom one right here one right here and so you got another zephyrus right here which is that reflective color reflect very very oh, very reflective awesome beautiful in the back right here i think you got these screws i'm not sure if it's uh the memory is expendable but i think it is now like i said you know me oh also fear to mention unlike the hp omen i like all the corners are round look at it nice round nice white with a with a, with a silver bottom beautiful this is one of the most beautiful looking lap gaming laptop in the market right now or maybe to me one of the best looking laptops on the market period it's beautiful in design very beautiful very light very thin I do it's very round so you won't you won't hurt yourself too much this is fantastic and now uh, with most PCs that I've tested when I try to turn it on you don't get no juice which is kind of unfortunate so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna plug this brick in the wall and I'm gonna to try to see if there's any um I'm gonna put I'm gonna plug it in the wall first thing first and then what I'm gonna do after that I'm gonna power this bad boy up to conclude this video but like I said this is just an unboxing so thank you guys for holding for tuning in so let me just plug this in the wall real quick Before I do anything, I want to see if there's any juice. Cause like I said earlier, a lot of PCs that I tried when I hit the power, there's no juice. You got to plug it in first, which is kind of ridiculous. Unlike with Apple products, when you get the Apple products right out of the box, all you got to do is lift it up and it power on immediately. So I wish most of these companies would, would adapt that feature. So let me just try this one more time. See if we can open it with one hand without any issue. But first, let me see if there's any rubber underneath that would hold it. Oh, you got a nice rubber thing right here two long ones for the back and two short ones for the front so it should so you should provide maximum grippage let me see yep it holds it pretty well now let me do the one hand test nice and easy no hassle boom and it comes this nice little thing to protect this protect the screen and the keyboards beautiful presentation very beautiful okay i'm gonna wrap it up real quick so let's see as you can see right here, the AMD Ryzen 5900 series, the 5000 series, but this is the 5900 Ryzen 9 with the NVIDIA GeForce RTX. So you got one speaker right here, one, and another speaker right here, two. Where's the, where's the other where's the other two to make it four? Oh, with all, I forgot to mention, with all ASUS PCs, they always got four speakers, but they always got two on the top and two at the bottom. So the remaining two is on the bottom of the PC, as you can see right here. But I just love how this looks. This beautiful white, I don't know if it's called off-white or, yeah, I think it's called galactic white. It's beautiful. And the silver trimming complements it very well. Now, open it again with one hand, and again, the rubber that they have, the rubber feet that they have, is good, it's holding pretty well. The table is wobbling, so this thing ain't moving around. It ain't going nowhere. Again, one hand, open it with one hand. Oops, my finger slipped. Boom. I just gotta show you again. Awesome. The trackpad is very big, clicky. I love it. I like the way it's pretty, I like the way the keypad, the keypad is thick. 
to make typing very easy. And you got these features right here. You got the um, the volume up and down on mute. And this goes into their, um, I don't remember what the feature it is, but to unlock features like the RGB lights, overclocking, you gotta hit this. And I think you'll have to sign up for it. It's not a subscription we have to pay every year, but it's just to unlock the features of it. And again, they know to sell their products. RG Zephyrus. And the screen is pushed all the way back. So, so, the, so the heat doesn't blow on the screen too much. And like I said, look, at, look how beautiful this LCD screen is. You guys can see. Now, this power button, like again, this power button, it, it's also doubled as a fingerprint scanner to unlock it. And you can see some of the more features right here, aura for the span, for the fan. You can cut screen, brightness, display, other features. This is cool. So I'm gonna get into this real quick. Again, this is just a quick unboxing. So let's do, let's see if it's power on. Okay, let me get it out of the way for you guys real quick. So I'm gonna hold it real quick. Boom. Hmm. Yeah, this is nice. Let me just close so you can see. And it fires up. I think this is the first PC that I actually got where it fires up by the first touch. Every other one I had to plug it in and before it turned on, which is kind of ridiculous. This is it right here. So, good news guys. It fires up on the first touch. But every other one, for some odd reason, you won't fire up on the first touch. You have to plug it in first. I don't know if it's a safety feature or what. But for right now, I'm just gonna plug it in because I want to charge it up full, full, full. And it's right here on the left side of the charging. So let me put it up here. The charging port is just right here on the left side. So I'm easy, does it? Oh, gosh, I'm getting butterfingers right here. Wait, is it the right one? Oh, oh. <laughs> I was plugging it inside the 3.5 millimeter jack. <laughs> silly, silly, ain't I? Boom. So there's no light to show you that it's powered on. Oh yeah, crazy me. It's right here on the top, as you can see. The light's right here, the one in the middle, the green, that's for the power. To set up your device using a screen reader, turn on narrator by pressing Windows plus Control plus Enter. For more accessibility features, press Windows plus U, or select the accessibility icon in the bottom corner. Ah, and this one right here is for the light. I think it's for the, for the, for the screen and the keyboards. But I like the way from the distance, look at it, look. Beautiful. And the screen is pretty bright. This camera, well, the camera on the iPhone is not doing it any justice, but it's beautiful. But anyway, that concludes the unboxing. So it's gonna be Christmas time, so I'm gonna not gonna. So if I release the video before Christmas, that's fine. But if not, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year already comes from, from JC and my own pockets. Thanks for the uh, thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to watch the ads. You watch the ads for the 30 seconds. Content creators get a little penny, but if you skip it after five seconds, they don't get anything. So bear that in mind. Again, thanks for tuning in. I hope to see you guys in the subscriptions area. Where I see you guys subscribe, hit the notification, and I hope to see you guys like out the videos so you get noticed in the YouTube algorithm. Thanks again for tuning in. See you guys soon in the next video.